Good morning everybody from West Palm Beach, Florida. Now, I have been videoing for the last five minutes almost. What did I not notice? The red light wasn't blinking. I guess I didn't push the button right. Alize! Come on, go play in the grass. Get up here. Right at the end of that row of trucks is where we're delivering. They don't open up for a couple more hours. Looky, I see palm trees. All over the place. Don't know what kind of palms these are. They don't look like date palms. Don't look like coconut palms. Guess I can tell better in the daytime. More palm trees over there. Beautiful, beautiful night. I hope uh, we got enough light for you to see these sparse clouds here. No stars. Okay. You can't see. Okay, I, I see one. <laughs> yep, just one. Get out of the road. Get out of the road. Get over here. That's why I like the desert better. Now, the weather's beautiful tonight. Warm but not hot. She has already peaked seven times. Where in the world is she hiding it all? But, as I was saying, it's warm but not hot. Breezy but not windy. Humid but not sticky. So it's not real dry. The breeze is actually a little warmer than the ambient air temperature, which usually doesn't make sense, but it's blowing in off the ocean and the water is a lot warmer than the air temperature, so the breeze is warmer than the ambient air temperature, I think. I don't know, I could be wrong, but it sure feels that way. When the wind's not blowing, I feel a little bit cooler. Look around. And don't go chasing any lizards if you see them. <laughs> I usually take her out off the leash because there's usually nobody around. Most of the time it's in rest areas. Hey, no hiding in the shadows. Okay, this camera doesn't do that good in the dark. The other ones do better. Number seven. I was counting earlier uh, when uh, <coughs> I tried to, excuse me, record the first time. That's why I know the count. Uh, but it is absolutely lovely and nice and quiet and pretty out here tonight. I could live down here except for the lack of stars. I like looking at stars. More palm trees down there, more palm trees right here. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. But it's time for us to go back into the truck so I can edit up yesterday's video. I'm all caught up on them, which is a good thing. So I'm gonna get back to editing and then watch a little bit of Netflix or Hulu or something on my phone when I get done editing. After I uh, stopped recording, I ran Alize up and down the sidewalk a couple of times. So she's panting, panting, I'm panting. <laughs> Alize. Say hi. Come here. She's like, are you kidding? You want me to get up there? Come here. Give me foot. Thank you. Other foot. Thank you. Other foot. Thank you. 
You my girl. You my girl. Do you wink at me? <laughs> Tell me she ain't happy. She's a happy doggy. You sure did pee a lot. You did. Now go drink some water. I just love Costco so much. Have I ever mentioned that before? <laughs> 35 minutes to get unloaded. I'm hitting the exit now. I mean, Lord, they do a skid here. Sorry about the truck beeping. Because I don't have my seatbelt on because i got to get back out. How are they sitting here? There you go. Thank you. You too. There you go. Bye, baby. See you. See you next Sunday. I'll wake you up when we get there. You're done? Are you all done? <laughs> Alizé had her leftovers. Some chicken You're fried done. steak. Biscuits and gravy. Uh, so. Go get some water. And Chris got her, got her candies. Her little pillow candies. Yes, what are they? Duets. Peanut butter duets. So, one mile up the road. And I'm going to go pass out. Okay, just got up. It's time to go have dinner. Since we're in Fort Pierce, that only means one thing. We're going to Hokkaido. See you there shortly. It's a pretty night. Hey, I can actually see more than one star tonight. Not as much light pollution. Listen to the crickets chirping. This is Hokkaido. We're sitting out here for a minute. Alize sitting in the truck. I know you can't see her. She's staring at me. <laughs> so we're about to go in. Fishies. That's a big old pleco. That ain't catfish, it's a pleco. Yeah, that's supper. Yeah, Jonathan, Jonathan's was like this. 
They no. get big. Okay. <laughs> Take a look around inside here. Sushi bar over there. We really like this place. It's real good. Uh, the waitress remembers us. She's like, I remember you. <laughs> I know the order. <laughs> That's her. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> uh. designated dinner restaurant for Fort Pierce. Now, if we're stuck here more than one night, that'll be a little bit different. Uh, it's a little expensive to do every night. But, since we only come here every so often, it's worth it. So now we're on our way back to the truck stop. Now see, this is an advantage over being a company driver. I don't have to ask permission to go get some, go out to dinner. But uh, yeah, we like this place. This is one of our top favorite restaurants along our, where we usually go, our regular areas. We have designated places, or designated restaurants in different places, that if we're sitting there, we'll go to. still always taking advantage and cooking out or cooking in the truck but we cook out in the truck I mean we cook in the truck or rolling so if we have a chance to be off it's nice to treat ourselves a little bit but anyway back to the truck stop five miles away okay we're back Already went inside, used the restroom, snooped around. Time to lay down, relax, watch TV. And for Chris to go to sleep, it's quarter after nine our time. So yeah, I'm closing out early. But I know I got plenty of footage today. So if you like the vlog, please share. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye all. Looky, I see palm trees.